started the Institute for the Metaphysics of Physics here at Principia College uh, because in part um, our goal is to demonstrate mortal mind outgrowing itself. Mrs. Eddy says that observation, invention, study, and original thought will promote the growth of mortal mind out of itself, out of all that is mortal. And this is actually what's happening in particular in the field of quantum physics. Principia is the perfect place for Lawrence Doyle to be talking about metaphysics and physics. I've had the chance to sit down with Lawrence Doyle, Tom Fuller, and a few other uh, very high-minded people and just listen to what they have to say about the way the universe works and how metaphysically oriented it is. And that, that to me is, is really great. We're setting up a quantum optics lab here at Principia and there are 21 experiments we can do or we can dream up a new one and we hope several capstones for students will be done with experiments in uh, the quantum measurement problem. Those students that are qualified can join us out in California for the radio experiment and that's using radio telescopes to do what, somewhat what we did in the quantum optics lab except we're going to add the component of gravity. I was working at the SETI Institute and it's just really neat that you were interacting with these really accomplished people and then the other interns were working on really intense projects and it was really awesome to get to know what they were up to also. The way that Lawrence Doyle talks about physics and the way that it just works and that in some ways we have no explanation for it, but that in metaphysics we can explain it so well. It's almost perfect from a spiritual perspective to see that you know, quantum physics works so nicely when you apply metaphysics to it. Natural science has evolved toward the direction of metaphysics, of thinking of the universe as made of information instead of solid matter. In Mrs. Eddy's day, uh, Victorian science said that matter was a solid, objective thing. Well, we can never return to those things. Quantum physics community, you're going to find metaphysicians, not Victorian physicists.